Wilson was forced to consider making flea, tick, and mosquito collars for his dogs. Either that or just to calm them down, give them one sharp whack right in the head. <laughs> Between the eyes, preferably, it had become a busy environment. It's not easy to determine where anyone is on the food chain anymore. <laughs> and it will be forever funny watching a pig get stung in the ass. <laughs> so is the frog eating the mosquito or vice versa? Well, <coughs> well, I'm back to the mess. God, what a mess. So, okay, what I'm going to do here is uh, I've been uh, doing some other, another game, obviously. I was going to tidy up here before I do much else, to tell you the truth. Boy, it's just a disaster area around here. If my bees don't kill me, of course. I guess it's not full on summer yet. Uh, let's try one of these spoiling honey hams. There we go. I would have to clean up all this stuff. Uh, I'm going to let the camp kind of run down until there's less and less camp. I'm not going to rebuild every time. That's just crazy. You know, if, if deer clops can just come and do infinite damage, so be it. <laughs> I mean, it's like, oh, okay. Whatever you need to do. But spending all my time just doing winter and cleaning up behind winter isn't working for me, so. There's some things I want to, some ideas people have put forward, things I want to talk about as I have time between picking up all this crap. I'm <laughs> literally picking up all this crap. Now a lot of this up here is just me bringing the beefalo down and I need to bring more beefalo down actually. Uh, I was just taking a peek at Resurrection Central up there. Evidently everything's still fine up there. Now I'm getting comments how do I pick up things uh, with uh, without putting a cursor on them I guess would be the right way to phrase that and it's uh, Spacebar, control spacebar, attacks, I guess, neutral mobs. So, Wiki has a guide, and and uh, the Wiki Play Guide I don't agree with particularly. There's good things and bad things. You, it's almost impossible. This is a very beta, beta game. They're changing it a lot, almost constantly. In fact, it, recently it has been constantly. It hasn't been almost constantly. Uh, so a guide, there's, I'm not knocking the people making them, but it's outdated about as fast as it's made. Uh, a lot of things just changed in this one just over the period of, uh, you know, they made spiders harder, they made spiders easier, they made combat harder, they made it a tiny bit easier, they made uh, the armor not work hardly at all, they put the armor back to exactly where it was. I wonder if I ever had boards there or if uh, he broke them. He, like I said, I'm not fixing it anymore. It's uh, I'll do essential fixes that have to do with uh, you know basic storage and stuff like that. But I'm not going to rebuild this uh, every time there's uh, every time winter's here. It's just you know that's all I'd be doing with my game. Uh, I do want to go down and check on. Uh, I believe it's Jada Road and, and several other people mentioned they'd like to see me go look for uh, mosquitoes and I haven't done that yet. Hey Chester, what's happening with you buddy? And see all this stuff's all screwed up because uh, all the boxes and stuff that got uh, in fact, it's probably just as well to stop doing these damn things.
Now, I haven't, still haven't decided what to do with this game. I'm, right now, it's the most evolved and developed one I've got. So it seems silly to get rid of it until I've got something else to play in. Now, you don't particularly have to uh, have eyeballs anywhere in particular, and there seems to be some disagreement about what they do. I've seen a couple of people say that they bring on uh, summer, but I've also seen people that ate the eyeball and they got deer clops again, which is not my definition of summer. So, but see, we've spent a day just picking up stuff, and that's, uh, although, like I said, some of the beefalo problems were related to things I had done. And I could just kill all these damn things. I should probably stop trapping them. I haven't, I, it's doubtful I'll do anything with the ones I've got. Now, I think the last time I played Wilson, they might not have put the armor back yet. <laughs> they may have re-nerfed it. It's been a few hours. <laughs> Hell, I don't know. Now, farms I mostly use for uh, cookies. Because food's not really a problem with beefalo here. And, uh, uh, Warburner mentioned that the tent now is like a bedroll you can use over and over again. And I haven't done anything with that mechanism yet. I was going to go ahead and do that. I might do that and go see if we can round up some more beefalo. I want to make a wall, but I'd like them a little bit closer than they are. So that might be a place to start. So what the hell do I need for a tent? I think it's spider web, isn't it? Alright, it's uh unfortunately uh spider webs getting tougher and tougher. Uh actually it's kinda gotten a little bit easier. See there's bunnies in here. Uh it's gotten supposedly you can take this thing with you and use it whenever you want. Well, I guess you don't take it with you. So it's a bedroll you keep somewhere. Okay. Well, I guess I accept that. That kind of makes sense. I guess I'm going to have to read that. See, my, I guess... What the hell? Did a buddy go through there again? Well, that's probably a waste of time anyway. We'll put all these out here where there might be hounds. But anyway, that's uh, done and uh, credit given there. Uh, let's go see if we can do something with the uh, beefalo horn. Well, the landscape is littered. Oh, shit. I didn't even think about not having a hat on. Yep, sir. I did that when it really mattered and they didn't break up at all. Huh. Okay. Actually, I want the ones further north than these. If you haven't seen that footage, uh... Deer clops killed about eight beefalo and may or may not have damaged a bunch of other ones. But I wound up with a lot of dead beefalo. In fact, I have a lot less beefalo than I used to have. Now let's try from here. I may just have to move up here. Now, somebody was laughing, saying they obviously had enough stuff to move these guys, but if deer cops and tree guards keep killing them, I don't know. How many have I actually got? Quite a lot. Now, I'm going to build some kind of wall down there to keep them from migrating too far, or maybe just not move them as far as I did last time. I was hoping they would uh, kill deer clops, and that didn't happen at all. I've heard they have killed him, but mine weren't up to the task. Yeah, I want them close to around the effigy. Sadat704 mentions he carries a torch and a stack of pine cones and plants trees and burns them in the winter for heat, which makes a lot more sense than, than, 
you know, than spending the cost of a campfire. A lot of this has to do with hounds. The hounds have actually been tougher than deer clops. Now where am I actually? A little further wouldn't be a bad thing. I'll probably stop for the night though. It's going to be the first game where I cared that there were a ton of beefalo around to irritate the hell out of me. Now I want to run down and check on that whole mosquito situation. Uh, but... I don't want to do it when I don't remember the last day hounds came in this world, to tell you the truth. And all these traps, I... Oh, I know why. I had all these spider traps. I'm not even going to wind up planting a spider nest this time around. There's just not going to be time. What I want to do is go down and see definitively what this does. It's the night of 3.57. We're at 58. I don't think it affects food at all anymore, but I could be wrong. <laughs> I can't read them there. We got 190, 67, 58. <laughs> So it ate all our food, so you couldn't die doing it <laughs> if you didn't have food really close. And it restored health and sanity. So that's good. It's uh, perhaps a little harsh. Now, did I hear a hound or not? The game, I'm not sure if there's even any reason to collect seeds anymore. I want to put a bee mine up there also. Uh, Frodo0111 suggested putting a bee mine up by the... Uh, beehives he was thinking more of my other world because it's winter there now which will make it kind of tricky to get them uh bee mines this is i used bee mines when they first came out and i lost track of them so i need four bees all right uh i never got back to them it was just one of those you know by the time, I just never figured out what set them off. It could have been, well, it shouldn't have been a stray pig. It was in my first world. But uh, it could have been a beefalo or it could have been a rabbit or I guess rabbits could set them off back then. I don't know if they can now. But I had never had any idea what the hell set it off. Now, you could just uh, do space bar to catch bugs. And I was told they'll target the bug if there's a flower and a bug there, which obviously that did. Uh, my problem is when I've done it with... Now, that one caught the butterfly. My problem is when I've done it with butterflies, he winds up doing this little jerky dance like that all across the screen forever, just like he's doing now. And that's why I don't use that to catch butterflies. So He might have actually been going for it there. Maybe you have to kind of stop. All right, you got that one. All right, but what we were after now, is there another damn board on the ground? <laughs> of course there's another damn board on the ground. Okay, be mine. And I haven't read up on these in a million years. And I don't even know if the player can set them off. Let me go see. I would think theoretically you can't. Oh, well, that's actually very easy. Okay, so you need the butterflies to fly and then land and then just do space bar. So I was making that harder than it is. Well, there you go. I'll have to cut some kind of an addition to that uh, video. I may put a slice of this in it and repost it. All right. That's very nice. Now, I have these kissing bees everywhere. And I haven't lost my mind. I was going to... I was kind of looking at doing another one. Or There's people carrying those things. All right, now let me check a couple of things, like when winter ended. <laughs> and uh, I'm going to read up on Bee Mines real quick here. And I do want to thank Frodo. I want to thank Jada Road. That's the mosquito thing. Uh, and there's going to be a bunch more. And there's going to be some of the other series I'm working on at this point. Uh, Bob Dole Trasher was one of those that suggested the, uh, the whole... I'm just going to set it somewhere. Actually, over to the side might be better. It's less likely to get beefalo. Bob Joel Trasher is one of those that suggested the space bar. 
I, I'm sorry, I'm listening to hear what that, trying to figure out what the hell I'm hearing. Space bar for catching the butterflies. It mentioned that if you had a butterfly and a flower, that it would automatically target the, the butterfly, not the uh, flower. Uh, WPID blocks, B-L-O-X, uh, mentioned you can catch them while they're flying. You can target them. And I, with my arthritis, I'm just no good at that. You know, it's not any more complicated than that. I was thinking about one more box just to get this. The problem is every box I make is one more goddamn thing for idiots. Oh, shit. We should have gone down to the swamp. Well, no, we haven't resolved the uh, whole hound thing. And I know you could take them through the swamp at night and get them tangled up in tentacles, but that could be a real dicey thing to play, to do. So...